big dance. The one and only. <laughs> there are that? loads of dazzers though, by the way. You drinking though? That's I say, no, 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 you drinking? No. What, you got drink? You know this guy, you know what he does, innit? You go out, drink, 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 drink. After the sixth drink, specs. Dash his car keys. <laughs> <laughs> Drop yourself <laughs> home. <laughs> So they drive it all after that. <laughs> <laughs> I can see it as well, from a dance style. <laughs> I'll be honest, um, for the last few days, I've been in a good mood knowing Daz is coming on the rules. It's true, man, Daz, man. I'm back. You know what I mean? Me and, da- and Tigo was in a bad mood with them other guests. <laughs> It's no rules. It's, 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 we can do this, innit? You get, you're getting yourself in trouble a lot lately. Oh, no, no, no. I know, I know. Oh, young Philly, I apologise, man. Because I said 5K. It was actually 50 bags. It was 50 bags he asked for, man. There's <laughs> no rules, but hey, I mean... What made you say that yeah. Philly asked for five bags after recording an episode of No Rules That Doesn't Exist on Becky Bambino's podcast? I don't know. I, oh, alcohol. Alcohol makes you lie? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think so. Do you lie when you're drunk? I don't think so. He does. He no, like, doesn't. He says he can't drive. home. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, though. In the spirit of Dazza being back, I got, uh, I got him a gift. Oh, oh it's about actually, time. I actually got you both a gift. It's about time. You got me. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. There's, there's only, only a few people will understand this gift. Oh, My G. I appreciate you know what? it, bro. So See, I appreciate it, boy. for Dazza and Specs. They're going out later. <laughs> I've got three in my pocket now. Yeah. <laughs> See, uh, uh, Dazza you know us. keeps a minimum two oh packets on him. Bring them out again? Oh, <laughs> But I know why he's got two. Because you're going to ask for one and he's going to go, that's yours for tonight. And that's it. Don't ask for no more. <laughs> Specs? <laughs> that's yours. <laughs> if you get to your last two, you don't reach out for mine. <laughs> <laughs> and to make sure you don't eat my soft mints, <laughs> he touches them with the yellow part of his eyes, knowing that I ain't gonna eat petrol and soft mint. <laughs> hey, PK, I'll keep telling you my idea, you know, man. But yeah, my me and Dazzle was in South London yesterday. Vibes in. Yeah? Yeah, I went to the four. vibes were... mediocre ish. So. <laughs> yeah, it was me, it was me. But yeah. it was more me's though. Me and Daz were yeah, the only yeah, guys in it. Yeah, were. so the, the venue holds 180 people. There's 50 people in the dance. It's got three floors though, right? Four floors. Is no? it? It's got the first level, which has got the glass front. Then it's got downstairs. Then it's got upstairs. Then it's got the roof. Mommy's got law as well. But anyway, there's 50 people in this dance. Two guys, me and Daz are. And probably the DJ, three guys. And there's just mommies just dancing. So it was good. We, 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 had, we had a good time. But you know Dazza, you know Dazza, what I love about Dazza is we, 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 <laughs> we walked in and the girl came up to us and said, yeah, we, we know who you are. Yeah, she's one of the 100Ks on No Rules. She gave us a table. So she's giving us a table, we're sitting on the table. And Dazza's there, Dazza's feeding himself. He's looking around. Now you know Dazza's one of those guys, when he sees people eating, like when he sees a lobster hanging off a tray, yeah, yeah, <laughs> he's yeah. got his hands up. <laughs> Somebody come to me. <laughs> I don't want to waste these soft mints. This is true. When Daz is out. <laughs> yes. And he's thinking about food. Most, I, th- I think a lot of people, when they go out and they think, oh, I could eat, they just kind of store it. It will come, it will go, whatever. Daz is like, you're, you're losing for like five minutes. He catches his eye and he's doing this. You know, Daz, what's going on? He's like, I'm just looking for the menu <laughs> still. Oh my <laughs> days. He loves the menu. <laughs> he said to me that. Let's go get me a menu quickly, please. <laughs> okay, <laughs> toilet. <laughs> okay, so, go and make a menu. <laughs> Hold it, menu. <laughs> so now T, yeah, he's got his um his chips and um was it crab? What was it lobster? No, prawn, prawn. Prawns, prawns. Prawns. He loves prawns. Wires everywhere to you, yeah. <laughs> so he's just sitting there. Remember, we've got mummies around us. <laughs> 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 what was the music? It was a lot of ba- it was a, uh, a piano house. Oh, okay. But he's doing bashing moves to it. <laughs> <laughs> and when Daz is happy, he offers you food. Specs. Chip. <laughs> he knows I'm not going to put my hand in there after you've <laughs> <laughs> put petrol in it. There's no way. <laughs> so, see, he's there eating, eating. So, our little section with the mummies decided to like, we'll go downstairs to the bar. 
But we didn't know that it was like an album launch party. Oh, too. wow. <laughs> That's why you got a table. So that's why we got a table. Yeah. So imagine everyone's come downstairs. So the um, the artist now is on the stairs. She's got the mic. She starts performing. Wow. Dazzle <laughs> is sitting behind her by himself. <laughs> you <with bronze>. <laughs> 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 like, I can't get downstairs. He's, <laughs> like he's part of the show. <laughs> Everyone's recording her on the stairs. You can see Dazzle's knees. <laughs> She performed like three tunes, so Dazzle was there a good 15 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I haven't seen you this year, have I? No, I don't think you have, man. 2023. Is it? Yeah, Dazzle's yeah, Dazzle's Dazzle, 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 gone now. He's gone. He's gone. It's been a good year. Because you ain't seen us? <sighs> no, because it's been a good year. I got a jizz up. Got myself a jizz up. <laughs> What's a jizz up? A job. Oh! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my God. <laughs> Some of the stories from these, <laughs> it's an undateable who dropped it. <laughs> All jobs are undateable. I had, I, had couple, I had a couple sneakers still. Is that my first job from what, 2009? <laughs> so I said to him when he came in, when he came downstairs, I said, Dazza, man, I missed you. I want to I wanna ask you what's been going on, but I don't want to waste it on the show. He said, don't waste it on, don't waste it. Don't waste it. It's got to stay on the show. That's what you do. So what are you doing yourself? Well, I got myself a little job. Obviously, I tried to do the entrepreneur thing with you. <laughs> no, with it, <laughs> that's, that's next. Tigo doesn't know about our secret uh, business partnership. You got a business partnership? Me and, D- T- me and Daz have tried to start a business here. Yeah. What was it? The Chiefs of... Oh. Have you got the yeah, files? Yeah, wait, you, you, wait. Got the files? Yeah, you got the files? You got the files? Let me show them. Jordy, don't look, man. They got Jordy in the building. No rules, boxes, and socks. But you didn't try this business. Why? <laughs> just making pants and socks is not making a business. It is. It is. What are you talking about? What's the all, all right, let me just let me, let me tell you what's a business. Let me tell business. Go on. Dazza said to me, Specs, this is how much it costs to get this box as a sock stuff. Yeah. I said, Dazza, pay it all. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> pay it all, and I will be responsible for selling them. He's paid all the money to you. Not, we haven't gone halves. He's paid all the money. He's given them to me. I've left the box in his house. They haven't been sold. They've been jamming. And he wants his money back. <laughs> Take <in> mind. <laughs> I've stepped aside. Furlough. Oh. I've stepped aside. So T, we're stuck. How many? Bearing in mind, this was, this was, I bought this in COVID. Bearing in mind, that's how long ago I, I had these. 2020, yeah. yeah. And he's wore every single, <laughs> not every <laughs> one of them. Yeah, not every single you one. You've all them, but how many boxes did you order? I can't remember, about 300? 300. Like how many is left? How many, is there 300 in there? Is that what's He's left? Like one He's one. wore XL, <laughs> L, M and S. So my boxes keep running out, they keep running out. I keep forgetting to put a wash in, so I've got to wear some of these. <laughs> Couple of these have been worn in there, but they're still good, that's what I'm saying. Oh my God. You can tell by the different in touch, right? let me show you. I mean, show, yeah. not... So these, I think these are the fresh ones. No, they, they can't be. That's not fresh. They are fresh. <laughs> these are fresh. fresh. <laughs> these are fresh. These are the fresh ones. One sec. <laughs> <laughs> it's not fresh. <laughs> Look, you can tell the difference. And these are the ones that we've worn once. Yeah. Oh, but let me see. Let me see. So I'm doing these. I'm selling these half price. Give me that three fifty. Worn by you. Like, yeah. <laughs> and these are the fresh ones. You can see. You can see the difference. All right, crowd. What do you the, think, though? You might hold on. Let, hold on. What do I think? What you guys <laughs> might be, you guys might be watching this, thinking this is like some co- pre-content for advertising no rules pants and socks. This is absolutely not that. Specs has been wearing no rules pants a lot over the last couple of years. I've never asked him what the deal was. Is uh, and here they are. Crowd, would you buy no rules pants and socks? Do you know he said to me? To- Oh, he said, ask Tigo like, like, about this idea. I said, hell no. You should have just <laughs> him and Jordy will be ripping me to pieces. I don't hate that idea. That like, no rules where I've said in boxes. Yeah, but like you go and you do meet and greets, you meet people, do some social, 
like introduce yourselves as a people this that like your I'm content. This is what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. You weren't saying you're nothing. Not you weren't saying nothing. This is what I'm saying, man. So what, we should have done this. You gonna help us? How many have you got? Right now? <laughs> I think I down to about 40, 40. <laughs> All right, I'll tell, you, I'll tell you what we do. I'll tell you what we do. Because this is good. This, we're talking business now, yeah? You order the next patch. And I, I'm responsible for sending them to me. No, you've, you've, worked backwards a from a, you've worked backwards from a, the wrong starting point here. Right. The idea is not bad. The idea is solid. Mm -hmm. The product yeah. needs some work. What do you mean? Pass and socks is a great idea. Yeah. By the way, T, 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 by the way, there was a, there, allegedly, Dazza made an order and someone ran off. <laughs> someone flew. <laughs> <laughs> you know them, you know them, uh, Judy, you know the bottom of the right, when, some, when you're buying a product, someone says, buy it off me. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, Dazza went straight to him. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> the guy left. <laughs> Get my money, Phil. This doesn't feel like bad product. Is it? No. I just feel like they're too big. Right, Dazza, well, let me take large. Let me take all of this. It's like basketball socks kind of thing. Let me take all of this. Huh? this let me take a, it. This is a good quality. Let me sock. take it. You gotta pay me for this, man. What do you mean? No, you we, we're we're it, Remember, we're business partnerships. So what are we gonna do? What are you gonna do if you take it? <laughs> I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna analyze. I'm gonna put it in my office. I'm gonna analyze what we're gonna do next. How, many, how many how many have you got left? What boxes? Everything. Uh, okay. Do cool. just do a do a off the top of your head Rough stock check right now. Dazza, I want you to be honest with your heart. About 50, maybe <laughs> what's this? One five. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay what, how many no, 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 hold on. That, that, no, that's not seriously, because it's business. Because we gave out a few as well, remember? No. I gave some to you to give out. Uh, yeah, what, you gave me like 10. Yeah, okay, cool. so where, like where's, the, where's, where's, the, where's the, where's the rest? Yeah, that's where, where's the rest? Where are the rest? Some in my house still, I think I've got a couple no, 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 of them. No, 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 yeah, but you can't be wearing smalls and mediums in there. Why not? where are they? Why not? Of course I can. Of course I can. If I run out of boxes, I could put a small one still. It's a bit tight, but really? <laughs> you have got <laughs> the <laughs> smallest <laughs> pipe. <laughs> oh, you need to come on, man. The girls know this. <laughs> girls get in the comments. Get, know girls that. get in the comments and talk and let them know that. No, I can't. That's for a reason. Uh, and I, I'll vouch for him to you. Honestly, you you growing up, no, no, like, not like that. <laughs> but there's, you don't, you don't the mummies. You know the mummies have said. Mummies have said. Dad has got a, a serious swung. But he got no kids. But he doesn't have to use it. You got no kids. They say that I don't have to use it. No, I didn't, it's not me. Why are you, are you talking to me? No, no, but no. But they all can't. They all can't. They must be me. They all can't. What for them? Or bad or good? They all can't. Wait, so you got no kids, right? Yeah. Small shorts, small pants yeah. might be boiling your loins. No, no, that's yeah, not sweating. the problem. That's not the problem. I'm not What's ready. the problem? I'm not shooting blanks or nothing like that. Like of course you are. No, I'm not. Like everyone says. What bomb scares have you ever had? What bomb scares have you ever had? had You've one. never had one I bomb? had one. With who? With the girl you, you um, introduced me with. Where who? Well, um, the only one. The only one. About where who? <laughs> the only one you gave me. <laughs> this guy's only giving me one. What? You only bought me three once. What? You only give me one free once. No, you don't have to yeah, be so detailed. No, we will. Because they can come in the comments and I need files. Wes? Yeah, Wes. There was no bomb scares there. Of course there was a bomb scare there. She will tell you. How many socks have you got? I got me I got so many socks. I got a lot. That's a he wants to invest. Box of socks. He wants to invest. I can, t I can tell from his nose. He wants to invest. No, I don't want to invest. I don't yeah, want Dazza yeah. to have unnecessary product because you geniuses didn't think about how there's actually a network where we can sell stuff and all we needed to do with if you guys wanted to create everything yourself, look, fullfit5.com. Look there. It goes there. Uh, we could sell them tomorrow. You know what? I'm I'm People sure would want, this is a good quality. I am sock. sure. I am sure. And that's a, on a serious level. Five minutes, no rules. I am sure. I came to you with this idea, and no, you slammed the door in my there's face. There's a difference between an idea and we have 300 pairs of socks and 300 pants. If you I didn't know, not, not if you had 300, anymore. If, no, <laughs> no, 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 you didn't know. No, I had no idea. So when I wore them boxes. You didn't, you didn't. You've, you've worn t-shirts with your face on it. You've worn t-shirts with no rules. You've worn so, so much. Never, you've worn never hats. Came to you you want... I told you about. Never. Never. Dazza, we, we've got to start business. Are you, are you ready to? All right, Dazza, shake. Let's be business partners now. Yeah. Yeah? Tia, are you in? So what's, what's, what's your role? You know what? You work for, you're going to be assist. You're going to work for us. You're gonna be our, yeah, we'll hire you. Yeah. I'm, I'm now going to host the sale. Yeah. I'm going to be the retailer for your product. Dragon's yeah. Den, I'm in. And then we're going we need, to need jewelry. And I say I. Filthy is I. I yeah, just need manage the account. Judy, cool. I, don't know, I don't know what size you are in boxes. Yeah. In probably XXXL. <laughs> yeah, we we'll do that. So we need you could, that stretch. Yeah. We've got to think about them, man. Yeah, so he's the, mod, he's the model. He stretches <laughs> it, makes sure that it really <laughs> goes out, <laughs> innit? Yeah. Is that cool? 
these pants and these socks are available on filthy5.com right now. Limited quantities. You can buy them today. That's Done. amazing, man. See that? That's hey. business. Right, hey, on, come here, bro. We're good friends, bro. We're good we friends. Up now. We up. We I, up. I love you, man. <laughs> we up. One day. One day what? <laughs> Ramos. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about that way. No days. No days. <laughs> But how's, how's everything been in general other than that? 2023. Right. Like I said, I ain't seen you a lot. Been busy. New job and all that. <laughs> Why are you laughing at the end of new job? <laughs> because people, get, if, stuck, if people get stuck in vans, that's why. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yeah, I'm stuck in my job. van still. <laughs> <laughs> in my new job. <laughs> you go out a lot. Um, you're, you're a party guy. Party animal, I would say. I wouldn't say that. I've been... Ah, yeah, I will say that. I will yeah. say that. I will say that. You, you get recognised a lot. Yeah. It's getting better, you know. It's getting better. Because you're kind of so. the people's champ. I am the people's champ. I am the people's champ. Yeah, I've got, I got notice. <laughs> I've got a story. I've got notice at work, yeah. And my friend, we got KY. I had him on the phone, innit? Because he helped me. He got, helped me get the job. Put me through and all that. Imagine I'm doing work. I'm jumping out of the van. A car's pulled up to me. He stops and says, brother, I love what you're doing. Well, I'm in my full uniform, so I think, what do you mean he loves what I'm doing? I don't really like <laughs> what I'm doing. Like that, you know? So I got to him, I was like, what do you mean? He's like, yeah, man, filthy feathers all the time, man. I love this one. That he said, he actually said that you're his favorite. Really? I can't what? believe that. Some room of him. What? He said, yeah, Tigo's his favorite. So I was listening, but obviously, I'm not taking it in. <laughs> Julia, <I'm gone. laughs> I couldn't believe it. <laughs> Tigo, you got one man. Yeah, facts. <laughs> one man. One fan a day. That's mm. what Norrie said. He said he keeps it. He said he keeps it consistent and he's real. That's what he said. I've always said about the rest of you, man. I don't know what he means I about that. I said yesterday. Hmm? So like, yeah. that guy that gave us a shot yeah. yesterday. That's what he said about Tigo yesterday. Tigo's so from Dan well, Memsides. He's real. Yeah, yeah, facts. Get out of here, bro, man. <laughs> Two. <laughs> but anyway, I was saying so. You didn't tell me this. No, I just remember. I just remembered. Mm. Well, can I finish? Sorry, sorry. You, sorry. Go, around my, go, you ah, go to my yeah, part no. of town. No, no, you know my name's coming up. You know my name's coming up. Go on. Go on. Go on. Tigo, you guys. I just, you just go. You just, I, when, you, when you said you were going there yesterday, I thought, all right, what's happening? Oh, Tigo! Go on, Tigo, this guy. <laughs> so he's pulled up. But I'm in his own. I never hear him. <laughs> 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 he's loving it. He's loving it. I wish I had told you to go. I wish I had told you. God does all. So he's got so he's got two he's got two girls in the car, right? So he says, Bro, Two girls in the car. He's got two girls in the car. But obviously I didn't I didn't see them in the back. So I've gone to the front. So he's talking to me. He's like, Yeah man, he loves filthy, this and that, man. Keep going on there, man, but stick up for yourself, this and that. Something. I don't know, he must become miles or something. Yeah. <laughs> Miles is <laughs> next to <laughs> Watch your mouth. <laughs> he must become miles. <laughs> So obviously when we're leaving, I'm like, love, bro. But because you've got two girls in the car and they're looking at me, I said, I love you, bro. Yeah. <laughs> now, you have moved off here. Yeah? Why are you driving what? off? I can hear the girls in the back. <laughs> Did you just see that he loves you? <laughs> <laughs> the car's gone off, yeah? I've got game on my ear. Bro, did you just see that you love him? <laughs> now, I'm all over the place. <laughs> Fully lost composure. I'm looking at the car, I'm like, right, come back, come back, come back, come back. Let me save my soul. So I thought, let me tell you the story before he says it. <laughs> but I don't mean I love you like that with your big face, yeah? Because I remember you had a big face. What I meant to say was, love my brother, not that I love you still. <laughs> The girls are just having a coffee. This, this guy's a weirdo. How can you say, I love you, <laughs> instead of love, my bro? Oh, my God. <laughs> and I know he's watching this one there. I know you, you know what I'm talking about, still. Bro, I didn't mean like that, still. Bro, if you're watching, man, big yourself up, man. Please, in the comments, please. <laughs> that one there stunk, man. Oh, my God. Oh, mate. KY's not letting me get away with that one there. <laughs> we need more Dazza. Yeah, of course. You could. I miss this. Oh, man. But that's 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 his whole life now. Got recognised. I get recognised quite a lot these days. Had still. prawns. Yeah, you, you should get recognised more, man. He's he, he's he's actually helped me. Like now, when we're going, we're walking back yesterday. I have no ID, yeah. and I'm like, oh man, there's no ID. I'm in South. It's like, bro, you you they watch for don't worry. And we're just walking, and people are just like, come in. And your oldest oldest that. Do I look old though? Yeah. Is it? Yeah. You're old as well, though, T. So. Yeah, is, but man. I'm not walking around trying to drift into Soul Bar. In yeah, Tuckerman. see, I invited you yesterday, in fact. I remember that. I, I mean, you didn't really. I did. I said, uh, me, and said me and Daz were going yeah. Soul Bar. So why did you just say, I'm, I'm coming? Oh, I didn't want to go. You never come out, though? Yeah, right? why? Not I really... do come out and uh, not really. You're not you really. didn't meet your friend, man. Even, man. I remember a couple of years ago, 
I was going out and clubbing a lot. Clubbing was cold, didn't it? It's hard, didn't it? Can be. Saturdays and like Sundays, Saturdays, Fridays and Saturdays are a bit. I like Essex-y. South. We're g- people, if you're from South, what we're going to be in South a lot, me and Desa, because we thought, you know what? We do North, East. We obviously don't do West. West don't exist. But we're going to start battering South. I can't wait to find a nice situation. Even a couple of situations are copying me now. You like situations now? Yeah. We, huh? You like situations? You say I like them? Yeah. You never like situations. What do you mean I didn't like situations? So what else? What do I like then? What are you talking you like about? Mo- you like mummies? Yeah. With big fighters? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So what's oh, the what? situation? What? What? A bloody. What? Oh, yeah, I, like, I love them. No, you don't. No, you I love don't. them. No, yes. You don't. No, you don't. I had a few of my right. at my club in, a spit in my time. What? No, you didn't? Yes, I have. So, how come, okay, let me ask you this. How come when we go out and I'm with a situation, you wanna <laughs> look at this guy? How come you do that? Why? Because you act different. <laughs> you act way too different. <laughs> yeah, so, definitely. Let me tell you what this guy does. <laughs> when he has a new situation, yeah? <laughs> That's what are you drinking? <laughs> Let's get a bottle. <laughs> remember, remember that situation you had, yeah? Remember that situation you had? He had a situation, he went out, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> he, out, he, do, he took the situation out with him, yeah? It was me, you and Runner, innit? Yeah, yeah, Runner, yeah. yeah. Big up Runner. Go to the bar, yeah? <laughs> he's bought a bottle of, he's bought a, what did he buy a bottle of? He bought a bottle of Hennessy or something. Yeah. Hear him, is that it? When he gave the price, is that it? Let me buy another bottle. <laughs> oh. Bear in mind, they're the only situations in that club. So we're just jabbing there with these situations. <laughs> oh, with the rest my. of the girls. Oh, <laughs> two, six bottles. We're making it rain. We've got these situations, but I'm in Lake Airport. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. oh. They're looking at me like, what the <laughs> hell are you doing? <laughs> so you don't know about seed watch stress. <laughs> you don't know. <laughs> You're not sharing the drink. Oh, that's a, that's a, <laughs> guys. I'm on all that. Damn, my God. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I like you, Lagos people. Oh. I try to make space, but yeah, I make space between them. And then some guys just come and started jiggling. Remember? Yeah, yeah, they gave the, 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 the situations brought their brothers. They came to the club, they started jiggling off my bottle. I wanted to rip the bottle out of their no. hand. Six bills! It come like, up to He too. does that though. We'll go out somewhere and Specs will just pull up to the bar, be like, T, let's buy a bottle. <laughs> I'm like, no. He goes, why? Is it probably going to be a half an hour? Yeah, yeah, true, true, <laughs> true. That means, that means he's loving the that club. That means someone in the yeah, club. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's like one person in the club, he wants to buy a bottle. I've got a game, man. You know, I've got a game. I've got a game. <laughs> Buying bottles, that's that's. Do you know what? Yeah, man. When you buy a bottle, you, you just feel like yeah, you feel like mummies are gonna be onto you, but it doesn't, it doesn't mean nothing, does it? No. I think I think one thing we're doing with your brand, right? Mm-hmm. The brand of Dazza mm. is making people excited when it comes around. Mm-hmm. Like, don't get me wrong. I think you'd be good on every show every week, but the fact that they have to wait for you means that when you come around, it's like yeah, Dazza. There's a wrestler like that. There was a wrestler like that to you growing up. Right, he wasn't on every week, but we used to we had, like when you come on, it was a big deal. But yeah, pe- people people just want more Dazza. Dazza talks, obviously, still something that I think we could trend with Dazza talks. If we announced episode one of Dazza talks, it would trend. People ask me about that a lot as well, so we need to get into that still. Is there any podcast you watch though? Do you watch any podcasts other than Filthy and No Rules? Um, no behavior, obviously no behavior. But apart from no behavior, um. I started watching that podcast that you were on another day with a girl. That drinking. Becky Bambino. Yeah, I think that was class. Um, She's got a bunda, you know? Yeah, big bunda. Oh, you checked? Mm, of course, still. Yeah. Another thing is, why do you get me on the opposite side with Chloe? With not, not Chloe, but the, the porn star. What's that porn's name? Nikki. Nikki, yeah. Why, why did I get you on with Nikki? You're asking yeah, why me. Why do you get me on there with her? What are you going to do, Des? <laughs> Wait, my, my name's Big Des. <laughs> They they now call me Devonte Wilder. <laughs> Devonte Wilder. Do they call you that? No, Spets, Spets calls me the other day. <laughs> Devonte Wilder. Uh, <laughs> like, bro, how can you come out of that out of nowhere? <laughs> Devonte Wilder. Trying good. to make it stick. I don't look nothing like Devonte Wilder. You do. You look like Wilder. No, nah, I don't. <laughs> you talking about? You, you don't like look Wilder. like Devonte Wilder. <laughs> yeah, that's the whole point. Oh right, yeah, but he's, he's Devonte. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's so random. Have you thought about what you do on Dazzle Talks? I had a lot of things, you know, still thinking about. I don't know, because there's so much. Everyone's just doing everything. Podcasts, yeah, there's too many thoughts. podcasts. I don't know. That's Maybe we've got to do like a short form, like six minutes of Dazza, pure Dazza. Yeah. We need to fi- we need to figure out a way of like, I don't know, maybe making people pay for your stuff so I'll get the money as well. Yeah. Because it's yeah, business yeah, no as well. It's business. This. I think if we just put the word Dazza Talks on some white socks. No, it has to be it has to be creative though, man. Yeah, I, I, would I, wear, I wouldn't wear Dazza Talks. It's got to be Dazza Talks with specs. My name's got to be somewhere there. Because I, I do everything for this guy from, from the first minute. 2003. One through ball. 
one free ball in how many years? Twenty I used years. To, that's I used to walk you to the bus stop. What? From Cali to Holloway. I like me. No, no, I mean, I used to walk. I used he, to drop you. He had to protect you with out the window when you were getting pressed in Hackney. Was it Hackney? Oh, no. okay, okay. Yeah, he's he's got. He's, he's, I mean, they call him Braveheart. <laughs> so don't forget that he. <laughs> yeah, if there's beef, he's front row. That's fine. I save a lot of people's life out right here on these streets. All right, look, we could probably just do, talk about nothing for the whole show, and mostly we will. But I just want to get into a little bit of structure with some serious Sundays. Dazza, we've asked Twitter for some questions. This is an important one. It's from Sovereign XCTZN. His Twitter name is Check Your Mirrors. Well, Who, who's Dazza's favorite filthy fella? And tell us why it's not Miles. I'll say, do your favorite <laughs> filthy fella. That's class. Who's not he it, knows, on this he table? Knows it's definitely not Miles. <laughs> he definitely. Um, who's your favorite to watch? Like imagination. That's not what I. Oh, meant. oh okay. No. I, I don't even know why you you said. I, I, I know that. Um, Lippy, go on. Why? Nah, Lippy's funny, man. He kills me every episode. Still, yeah. His yeah. takes, I think he's class. Um, oh, TK. Why? Uh, he's just a wonder kid, isn't it? He's a star boy. He's a star he, boy. Because he, like, he likes you, why? <laughs> nah, I don't think he likes you. Always on me. He's always on me in there. Does he remember you got competition with Hamza as well? Yeah. Huh? You got competition with Hamza? Nah, come on, man. He thinks he's better I'm looking flying. than you. I'm flying. He thinks he's better looking than you. Who? Hamza. Hamza. Seriously? <laughs> yeah, swear down. He f***ing wishes. What, he's flattered? <laughs> and he's been up nose. So Hamza, so Hamza. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes he just comes out. He just comes out sometimes. <laughs> but there's no way. I don't even think PK's not even that better looking than me. PK's not all that, you know. I don't know what get these, these, these um, nice BT. Well, hold on, right hold on, on, hold on. I don't think it's that. You're saying PK is not better looking than you? I don't think he is still. I'm putting that. I'm, 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 I need that, this clip here. <laughs> 33, 33 sleep minutes <laughs> to 14, <laughs> to 33, 20. And Jordy, I think they're my top three. Oh, I think you said Jordy's good looking. Nah, he, he knows, he knows, he knows, man. I'm next up. Like I said, man, I've been working this new job, starting to go gym. So I'm saying so I'm losing weight. No, I'm going to start I'm signing oh. up. <laughs> I'm signing up this week still. So I just want to find the best gym to go to. Where is the best gym to go to? We're going to talk about that anyway. Uh, oh, gym right. group. Hold on, hold depends, on. Depends where you are, really. I don't, I've never asked, you know, does this stuff. Like, you didn't say poet. In that list with Phil Furness. Why? I love Poet still. Yeah, but, but why do you say? I don't know. What? He up there? He up there with Tigo? Uh, <laughs> is he up there with you too? In what sense? Wait, hold on. As in? T- where, where, up there stuff? what? As in the best? Because Tigo's not. No, 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 no. no, no. Let's, let's Tigo's like. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, Tigo Southampton. Yeah, Tigo. You're, yeah. You're that, yeah. 100 percent I'll, I'll say more Bournemouth. What? <laughs> Southampton with Tigo. So, so. <laughs> so who's Southampton and Bournemouth? Yeah, Poet and um, Tigo. Oh, there we go. That's cool. You're telling me. In this looking good looking game, oh, you're in the oh, prem. Good oh, looking game, you're oh, saying. So what oh. you're saying? So Paul is you're wait, saying Paul wait, 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 what's <laughs> going on here? Yeah. This whole no, time buddy. this whole time he's been listing <laughs> yeah. people he finds attractive. <laughs> I didn't say I'll find So you said Lippy, PK. Oh no, 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 no. We're Poets getting, we're getting up there. Up. No, no, we're getting buttered up. We're getting buttered up. Jordy's number three. You said he's my favourite. You said he's my favourite. Um, Phil Feller. Phil Feller, innit? And yeah, then you so started talking three. about who you fancy. No, 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 no. Then we started talking about looks wise, innit? So I'm just saying. Oh. Okay, so he's. he's cause, I, Cause I asked him about the Geordie, so he stuck to that. T, yeah, T, T, look wise, you can't be Prem. Look wise. <laughs> T, you can't be Prem, honestly. I, I'm, I, it's, not even, it's not even like a joke or. You, you like, for me, you're below average. 100%. <laughs> Facts. Facts. T, you're below average. Where, <laughs> where are you? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> No, you, the, a scale, <laughs> a scale needs a baseline. <laughs> I'm cool, I'm cool. You put me in the baseline. Where, where are you to, to on yeah, the scale of this, that baseline? Where, 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 where are you, where are you? <sighs> oh, are we being honest? Yeah. I'm in the top four. <laughs> top four where? I like, what league? It's, uh, <laughs> it's proven, I've got like, if we're looking nah, at- Nah, 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 kids, nah, 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 it's proven. No, 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 looks, where are you? Not reputation. The only the only person that could argue me with looks is PK. I say Miles above me and Savage Dan's above me. That's it. So I'm fourth. I'll get. I'll say Savage Dan one, Miles two, PK three, me four. You four. Yeah, this, this is so so all right, all right, So where am I? This. <laughs> where am I? This? <laughs> That's what you know. Is you know. Is I don't think you're bad looking. I don't think you're good looking. But my aunt is for your Congolese. <laughs> what's what's that? Mean? What's wrong with that? <laughs> 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 T. 
He's West Indian, yeah. They thought he looked Congolese. And uh, Congolese people are not, uh, not butters. But he looks African, so for me, he's like, he's just, he's, he's a bit down. He can't be better than me. That's what I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I'm not I'm not being. I'm not being. Where's Jordi? Jordi's Congolese, by the way. Yeah, but Jordi's like is the and new. PK's Congolese. So they're the new Congolese. They're the new. You fancy PK? No, as number one. Yeah, they're the Jordi and PK, the new Cong. Actually, you know what? He's four with me. Because they're young. They got young faces. You look like you look like you look like the Congolese of the eighties, though. <laughs> Zach Zaykon. That that's, is that's rude. The thing. That is rude. You look like the old school. You Congolese can hate. You can hate if you want. But the facts are facts, isn't it? To me, you like Raggle's dad. I'm, I'm <laughs> <laughs> That's on my line. That's on my line. <laughs> Can't be my dad into this. That's f- <laughs> I reckon I'm, I'm top four. I'm top four, top five till. I agree with Miles, Savage Dan, and um, I say PK is just behind me. That's what I think. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. The rest is, yeah, the rest is. Poet is fried to your below average. Lippy, poet. there's too, Lippy there's too many days. girls that know that poet, so I wouldn't put him up there. I wouldn't put him up there at all. Interesting, so. interesting. <laughs> Mugs? Nah, nah. He looks sick. God, Spex, who's your favorite filthy fella? Oh, to watch. If you had to just tune in and watch one right now, it has to be Lippy. Yeah. Because the thing about Lippy, Lippy's been MVP. If the way he you, talks, he's been MVP. The, the last way he year. talks sometimes, yeah. it's it's interesting, and the way. He, like it, he switches, it's it's so it, uh, even even on the Twitter space when you hear him talking, mm. it's so interesting. Like, it's just I can't explain it. Sounds it. Like it sounds like he's gonna punch someone up. Yeah, but it also sounds like he means what he's saying at all times. And then the next day, yeah, guys, I'm sorry, man. Yeah. I was having a bad. <laughs> <laughs> T, come on, man. No one does it better than man. <laughs> you know what I mean? I agree. Uh, yeah. So Lippy, yeah, I'll go with Lippy, man. 100. percent I agree. Uh, Daza, this one's from Don Julio 90s, aka at the Ghost 24/7. We got at the ghost. <laughs> Wait, let me not big him up first. Let me hear what he's got to say. No, no, it's, it's, it's <laughs> calm. What was Dazza doing in 1999 New Year's going into the millennium? Oh, good question. I didn't know you then. Tom, put your hand, put your <laughs> fingers down. <laughs> Two fingers up. <laughs> That's a bit rude still. <laughs> now I've got a problem with what I was doing. 1999, going into millennium. I don't know. I was watching, Probably with... yeah, I think it was a Saturday. I was a kid. I watched WCW Nitro. Terrible episode. I just, oh, I just, just cut you off for a minute. Yeah. I think it asked me this question still. Yeah, but I know, but it's, it's, it's a podcast. It's a podcast. And I can't just let you sit here in silence, Bro, racking your brain wait, 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 wait. back to back to when you were 22. You're just like, this too. You're so marky, right? Let me land. I'm, try, I'm trying to give you right, time go, go, to go, go, think. Go, 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 I'm trying go, to give you time to think. Carry on, because you asked me the question. Well, I'll be honest with you, Daz. Daz, next week, please. The tweet does have my name in it. I just asked. I asked it to you because I thought maybe Daz is sharp. He's got Daz's talks right, coming. Let's, let's, he can't. You can't just have dead finish, air and just say nothing. Finish. Daz, you gotta be fast. Yeah. You gotta be fast. Daz's talks. You gotta be fast. Yeah, you gotta be quicker. No, I don't but you know, you can't tackle this. This is why your drafts you, are bad. You just this is why your drafts are bad. How many bad drafts have I had? <laughs> All of them. No, I'll say. I'll say probably one. <laughs> <laughs> I'll say probably one. Still, I would have called that one. Oh my god! What a show! Nitro. Terrible episode. WWE was done by then, and then I went to Vauxhall Bridge to watch the fireworks. 1999. That was the, 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 so. That was a year. Millennium. Wait, what day? What, what day was the millennium? Because Chris Jericho. What because day Chris, was the millennium? Yeah. What day was it? Was it was it a Saturday? Yeah. It was, all right. Because I watched Chris I, Jer- so. I watched Chris Jericho make his entrance. So was that on the actual day? It wasn't. I don't it? think it was not the oh, actual okay. day. No. So I don't remember what I done. But I thought the world was in. So I was at I'm home. Probably out. Out of dead rave. I've been to so many dead raves on. Yeah, you were probably yeah. mid twenties back then. Yeah. No, you'd be 20. <laughs> probably about 16. Probably not there, down there. Oh, well, probably for a girl. You know me, man. That was my prime days, still. So those were my Those were your days. prime days. Yeah. You're 23 years past your prime. What you're talking about, man. <laughs> let's, not, let's not beat up my age. So I'm that's young, no. I'm the millennium was 23 years ago. <laughs> <laughs> I know that's just 46 years old, yeah. I'm nowhere but near that. You know, nowhere I just realized if I met you in college, them days, you must have waited for me for years, bro, to come, to come there. <laughs> you just jammed there, boy. Flipping, oh, you must have felt business boy hard. Uh, this one's from Cree, at Chris Cree T, or Cree T, I don't know which one it is. What's the biggest animal Dazza reckons he can beat in a fight? No weapons. Mm. Gotta be quick, Dazza. Gotta fox. be quick. No, 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 let's, let's, let's. <laughs> definitely, a, probably a fox. <laughs> probably a fox, that's the biggest animal you, you can beat in a fight. Yeah, 
or a cow. I reckon I reckon I will, I reckon I will swing up a cow. I reckon I was, not a red bull, not a bull, but a cow. I reckon a I will red swing bull. up a cow. <laughs> he loves ET bulls. He saw a bull in Jamaica. I'll see a bull in Jamaica Look, for the first time. They don't mess massive. with these bulls, man. No facts though. Yeah, Bro, they are built different still. Mm. But yeah, I'll see your thoughts. A cow, a cow's bigger. All right, I'll go for a cow. Giraffe? Nah, I don't think I have a giraffe. So. <laughs> Mm, crocodile, yeah, I can just hold it by its tail, swing it around. No, you ain't. You are getting yeah. mashed by a crocodile. Yeah. No, crocodile spin. No, co- they look. No, you got no shoulder strength. <laughs> what are you grabbing? Oh, hey, that's another thing that you lot need to stop doing as well, yeah. Because at work now, that's a banter now. So I'm saying, since I come on there now, you start talking about my shoulders, and even one girl's clocked it. Like she was looking at me the other day. She went, "Yeah, I've got thin shoulders, isn't it?" You lot need to stop. Oh, they're joking though. Anyway. They're joking still. My shoulders are a bit just out. Put, just put just a camera. Huh? Yeah, yeah, just, just a camera. Good, still. Yeah, just put the pads on and just see your goal. Let's not talk about my shoulders still because this is I'm just the butt of everyone's joke right now. <laughs> I ain't really got a comeback for that one still. That's why. That's another reason why I'm gonna yeah, go yeah, gym. gym yeah. yeah, that's another reason. Work the shoulders. Gym's at, yeah. What's the biggest animal you reckon you could beat up? The biggest, yeah. You is not a big animal. A panda bear. Yeah, you could beat up a panda bear. One hundred percent. They won't fight back. They won't fight back. Yeah. But what about you? Obviously, once you start getting technical and say panda bear, cow, and that, I could beat up both of those. I don't think you could be up a cow. Big, innit? But How are you like, going to be up a cow? What do you do? What, that, what, you'd have the cow lying sideways, yeah? Yeah. How? Punches and kicks. Sweep T, the you leg. Can't, T, you can't punch. I don't think T can punch. You can't leg. sweep all four legs of a cow. You don't need to sweep four legs of a cow. Like, you don't need to sweep two legs of a human. Well, T, what, what, when it's done, be honest. <laughs> it's not my story. <laughs> That's not what my story. What do you know? What do you know? For a meal. A mill? Yeah. No. Nah. Does it would you for a mill? Of course. Of course. <laughs> Yo, money hungry, Stupid man. question. Yeah, of course. What? A mill's a lot? Of, well, it's not really that much money, Specs. but I would do it for a mill. Free balling. What, for a cow? <laughs> One mill. <laughs> well, you can't even free, free ball before. We got, so, wait, we got to sell a million boxes. To, to <laughs> That's true. <laughs> <laughs> we sell a million boxes, I'll find you a cow. I'll, I'll watch that as a, d- a drill a cow. That'll oh, be I love it. I love it. It's going <laughs> too far. Like, that that was amazing. One leg up. Always have to go too far. Always. <laughs> Moo. <laughs> Specs, this one's for you. It's from Vardan at Dan Mins. How much has Dazza changed since his first ever No Rules appearance? Oh, great question. Has he changed? Has Dazza changed? People keep telling me I changed. Is it? I don't know how. Uh, no, nah, honestly, I know. But like, we get people coming up to us saying Dazza's changed now because he, you know, Yellow eyes, you can't see things sometimes, yeah. which I get. Yeah. That's another thing you got to stop saying still, because you're just killing my girl, right? <laughs> when girls just, just focus in and go, oh yeah. yeah. That's what I'm saying. That's, that's not anything you do. I think that's kind of cop blocking, to be honest with you. So Digital can we stop doing that, please? Yeah, facts. Nah, but it's a conversation starter, isn't it? I don't girls think it's changed, but I think there's like a, like, I'm too sexy now. He always had that. Thank but you. it's worse now. You reckon? When, we, when we're walking now, like we're walking through a crowd in a club, he, does, he always did that. Yeah, facts. But, then, but, so, he's, but it's more like this. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I know about you? Like, you don't preview too much. <laughs> this is why you like, ain't got no gal. This is something you're too busy. T- <laughs> me. <laughs> but it's always just, what's Dazza doing? <laughs> <laughs> he's charging. <laughs> <laughs> but sometimes but, we'll go places. And I'll, I'll be somewhere. I'll do, whoever I'm with, if I'm with Jordy, if I'm with Specs, if I'm with PK, if I'm with everyone, I'll just tap and go, look at Dazza. <laughs> Dazza should be standing with a drink. <laughs> 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 you don't need to stop breathing. That's what you don't need to stop doing. But yeah, I get people telling me that I changed a lot. Some people even chatting to me because they think I changed so much. I don't hold at them before. Is it? I didn't even hold at you then. <laughs> I don't hold at you now, that's what I'm saying. But that part's annoying though. I don't think Dazza's changed. He hasn't changed, no, he hasn't no. changed. I don't think so, no. Nah. Thank you, see, I haven't changed, man. Stop telling me that. Because his name's been on the internet for eight years or whatever. You've been saying his name consistently on the internet for a long time. So people must be coming up to you going, is this Dazza? But he's getting that when but people will stop me saying specs. <gasps> oh, Dazza! Yeah. And it's like, it's, 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 it's great. We look it's at nice each other. We like it. it. Yeah, I like it. I like it. Man. But I for him, it's quite it's it's shocking. Because some, you know what it is, T? It's not, you because know, we can't see the crowd. Sometimes we might see, I don't know, like three goths walking with a guitar. Thinking, you know, when you see a guy walking with a guitar or whatever, you're gonna just walk past him. Look. Is that specs? Oh, I love my broski. Daza! <laughs> oh, you're a goth. When did you see Daza? So, Daza's yeah, man. He's a cult hero. He is, isn't it? That's what they're called. They're called cult heroes. Cult heroes? Yeah. Daza He's never to... done anything wrong. Everyone on Filthy's done something wrong to upset someone. Daza's never done anything wrong. Yeah. That makes him yeah. just a, the people's champion. He's like that in real life, it's true. It's true, you know. Yeah, I need to post in it. That's another thing I need to start doing. Oh my, fashions. I saw a poet at Industry Party the other day. 
And he tried to grill me. He tried to. He told me that I'm lazy. Bro, you're lazy. You're spitting in my face and all that, man. <laughs> it's annoying me still. But it made me think, though. Am I lazy? Do I need to post more? I think I do need to post more, innit? And interact with the crowd I and that. I just remembered, you know, there was a time when you were walking and Pert was talking to you. Me and you slowed down. I said, Dazzle, <laughs> you see your left ear? Put it in your pocket for the next 20 minutes. <laughs> Dazzle, I'm going to put you on wireless this summer. <laughs> you're going to tell everyone your story. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I love for it, man. <laughs> That's a jump point, by the well, way. Well. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, he told me I'm lazy. He says I need to um, post more on that. Not to good out, my manager. I didn't really ask for a manager here, but <laughs> <laughs> let me see what I can do with it. Let me see what Please I can do. Nelson <laughs> against Boom. <laughs> Eight times. How do you not make you get away with that so many oh, times? Bro, I don't know, man. <laughs> <laughs> I need, need point back on his show somehow. <laughs> He's thinkers, man. Oh, that's a box park. My God. This next question, last question, will go L Stanislas H at a rate. What's your favorite sandwich? You know what? I'm not really a sandwich guy like that, you know, to be honest with you. I don't I can't eat cold sandwiches. What? what, what about hot? Ones? Hot. Um, oh, like, okay. Ham yeah, and cheese. Yeah, yeah. I'll say Prep. probably chicken. Was it a chicken? Chicken? No, chicken with sweet corn. Chicken sweet bagel, corn. Bagel. Like, yeah, like a bagel sandwich. I don't really eat sandwiches still. Well, when we used to go bagel, like, what did you used to get? Jerk. Jerk chicken bagel. Oh, jerk chicken, yeah. Jerk chicken bagel's a good shout, though. That's good it sandwich. used to be. It used, yeah, I, think, I think it fell off. What's your favourite sandwich? You know my favourite sandwich, too, man. What? Ham and cheese. But you oh, take right. out the ham and leave the pollution of the cheese. <laughs> it's my favourite sandwich, man. You know how the way I eat this, isn't it? It's... <laughs> <laughs> It'll, it'll get halfway through a ham and cheese sandwich. Oh, I don't even want this anymore. You want this? His fingers have been you know all over it. The way he drinks. The way he drinks. He's the only person in like beyond the age of three years old who tucks their head back instead of the drink. Ha! <laughs> 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 I hate it. All right, you've been doing it for years. And it was like, bro, why'd you drink like that? Shut the fuck up. Man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <that's crazy>, man. <laughs> Oh, uh, worse. All right, boys. You know what it's time for? It's time for Noel's News. Remember wrestling, but you'll never get it right. Dazza, you've been watching a lot of wrestling. I have, boy. What a shame. What well, I feel sorry for you. Why? No, it's just not. I tried. It's not good. It's not good to you. No, nah, there's there's one interesting thing I've come back now. Bray Wyatt's come back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And I'm finding it mad interesting, but it just disappeared again. <laughs> I'm saying, and I'm. You know what's sad about me? I always every Friday I go on when it's finishes. Sometimes I don't really watch it. So on a Saturday I'll go on and look, type in Bray Wyatt. That's the first thing that comes up on my YouTube. Yeah. Just to see if he's come back, <laughs> done anything new. So I'm saying, what's the last thing you done? He said you called out what? You called out Bobby bro, Lashley. Bobby Lashley and Brock Lesnar, isn't it? Yeah. And he disappeared. Yeah. He's. I think he's injured. But I like. I like. You him. like him? Let yeah. Me I, I like him. He's creative. Um, if it's the guy with the beard, with the beard. Yeah. 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 The one we watched in that. You like him? Like, he goes on for things. I love that. I'm saying when he comes out. What's Dazzle doing? He's class. I is he class Dylan? I like the fiend when he was a fiend. Now he's come back as something. Where's he come back as now? Yeah, he come back with Uncle Howdy. <laughs> this was Dazzle came up to me a few weeks ago. I was like, T, have you watched WWE? And I was like, mm, no. I said, I'm really interested in what they're doing this Uncle Howdy. Who do you mm. think it is? I was like, All right, I'm going to study this, figure out who Uncle Howdy is. I don't know who it is, by the way. I'll try to figure it out. They said it might be, um, is it? Comment said Dusty Dustin Rhodes or is it Dustin Rhodes? That's the Gold Dust. Oh, no, that's no, why it's not him. It's the other one. Cody Rhodes. Cody Rhodes. That's right. It. It's it that's Cody the son. Yeah. No, his brother. Who's the son of Gold Dust? There is no son of Gold Dust. Bro, I thought that was his son the whole time. Bro. What happened? What happened to the other guy as well that had his hand in his pocket that you see the movies? His hand in his pocket. Oh. He's on AEW. Oh, he's why the did they w. sign him, man? He someone was always there. Orange Cassidy. Someone sign him, man. I think he's good. Someone sign him, man. Still does moves with his hands in his pockets. Jumps over the ropes with his hands in his pockets. Yeah, man. But I don't understand. Yeah, you think he's injured? Yeah. So that's what I want to talk to you about as well. I don't know where he's gone, but I'm waiting for him to come back. Until he comes back, I ain't watching. Why did he go missing? Then what's going on? He's injured, yeah. It's Wrest Wrest WrestleMania next week. <sighs> and he ain't coming back. I heard he's got a contract only to do the big stuff like WrestleMania. Or Rumble. That's, see, that's copying Undertaker, but that's Undertaker's thing. He's very much mm -hmm. like Undertaker. Is it? Yes. Yeah. Undertaker gave him the, um, what do you call it? Cosign. Cosign, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I saw that. Time, yeah. I did see that. I, yeah. I did see that. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I can't. So ever since you showed me that storyline, man, with um, uh, the, the rocks, bloodline. the bloodline, yeah. and that, yeah. 
That was great. Jordy knows oh, that's great. I just, I can't, I can't get into it. I'm trying, crowd. I'm trying, trying to get into it. I know you lot are sending you me videos. Almost. almost is class. That oh, almost guy, I like him. massive, boy. Yeah, I like him. I, I don't, like I don't, him. I don't know. He doesn't look like he can wrestle, though. He can't. <laughs> no, it's a fact. Like he, he can't. They put him in the ring and they're like, not what like, you need a lot of work, but your size is the biggest thing we've ever seen ever in wrestling. I see him try, he threw but less over the ropes. Yeah. He tried to throw him over the ropes. And, and it, it was flopped. terrible. Yeah, yeah. terrible. I was thinking, that's, yeah. w- that's one thing about wrestling. If you if I go to throw over the rope T, you've got to go over the first time. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. If you're halfway there and I've got to push you again, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's, it's done. done. We're done. Yeah. We're, done. Yeah. We're done. You never recover. Talk about wrestling though. Hmm. I watched a film with a wrestler in it. Oh my god. Who? Oh look, T. Knock at the cabin. Oh Batista. Do you you try to say Batista's a sick actor? Remember? Was it you or was it? Tell me you've seen it. I haven't seen it. Uh, it's um, uh, M. Night Shyamalan. Name. Is that right? Knock yeah. at the cabin? Yeah. M. Night Shyamalan. He directed um, Six Sense, he's Unbreakable. A, he's Glass. a bad wrestler and a bad actor. Uh, you, you, know what? I, I you know what's funny? I, I'll go on like WWE Network and try and watch some Batista matches. And I still think he's... <laughs> I couldn't get into Batista. I, c- I can understand. Oh, yeah, he's terrible. He's terrible. I can understand why people like... John Cena. John Cena works hard, mm. does good stuff. He's whatever. He's cool. Very like innocent. Randy Orton's sick. Batista, I just don't get it. I never got to move on. He's just big. He's just you know what he is. He's Ahmed Johnson. Yeah, he is, isn't it? Yeah, he's just Ahmed Johnson. If Ahmed Johnson was white, yeah, he's Ahmed Johnson. Get away with all this. Yeah. yeah, I don't. Wait, I watched the film and I was I was just looking. At, I was just concentrating on him. I was looking, thinking, this is bad. This is bad. I I don't know who's watched it or who ain't watched it, but let's go and watch it. Let me know what you don't think in the comments again. <laughs> I'm not saying that now. Stop, stop. This is not Dazza <laughs> Talks. I'll take the socks off the website. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Forget it, forget it. That's all. I need the socks on the website. Still. <laughs> <laughs> I need the socks on the website. Um, you know, Batista once had a fist fight with Booker T. Who won? 2006. Uh, it doesn't say... Booker T said that he thought Batista thought he was better than the rest of the roster just because he was uh, got to the main event quickly. Mm-hmm. So they had a fight. There's loads of egos backstage, isn't it, T? Oh, Who yeah. Who had the biggest ego? Uh, the same John Shawn Michaels. Michaels. Shawn Michaels. Yeah. Shawn Michaels. Bret Hart as Bret well. Ha- oh, my God. Bret Hart Yeah, he was, was the worst still. What was it, um, Hardcore Holly? He was just a bully. Can I ask you a question, T? Yeah. You know when me and Jordy saw that video of Hulk Hogan, The Rock, and Stone Cold in the rain? Yeah. Did you feel like they were looking at each other like... I didn't really like you, you know. They definitely, none of them liked each other. You could see it though, innit? Yeah, yeah. So that's ego, innit? The Rock grew up as a Hulk Hogan fan, though. Right. But they didn't like him. Stone Cold, no, none did, of them Stone Cold didn't care about Hulk Hogan, did he? No, he hated him. Does I'm ask you a question. The Rock and the Hulk, the Rock, Hulk Hogan, and Stone Cold are in the ring, celebrating their you 30 know, years of 30 Raw. Years of raw. In your opinion, who is the biggest wrestler out of them three in terms of reputation? Like when you when you go when you go to like it's Gambia, gotta be, it's gotta be you see it like on a bus, you see like a poster. Who? It's that's Hogan, probably not huh? the right. Yeah, okay, that's the right answer, but that's not the right way of framing yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. When you no say, rules. <laughs> There's no bus. <laughs> bus of wrestling no, Gambia. I don't know when what. You, I don't know what they're <laughs> thinking. Yeah. Yeah. Just check me around. When you go up to most people in the world and say, "Tell me the name of a wrestler," I reckon most people still say Hulk Hogan. You think Hulk Hogan is, the, is bigger than Stone Cold Steve Austin? In, in like mass media, yeah. Mass, in the mass of the world, yeah. I disagree. Yeah. What, you think Stone Cold is? Yeah. He was only Stone Cold for like three years. And those three years was he, yeah, but people, but people don't think of, when they think of wrestler, they think of Hulk Hogan. All right, so are we saying Hogan first, Stone Cold second, The Rock third? Or are you saying The Rock is bigger than Stone Cold? For just the Rock's thing. bigger than Stone Cold. Because forget of the film, movies. Forget films. No, but I'm saying just in, in, the, in WWE. In that era. Yeah, in, in that, that era. era. Oh, T, you're letting me... Oh, Stone Cold's man. great, but it's such a small period. The Rock has got another, like, six, seven years after that. It's tough, man. I think so it. why does Stone Cold feel like the best thing ever? Because he was. But then he did his neck. He had oh, no yeah. knees. He was, he, yeah, he was the RB. He, he, he was... <laughs> remember, he was, mid, he was mid-card until he was Stone Cold. Stone Cold is late in his career. He's already got you're kids. Right, man. With an English woman. Yeah. You're right. In Essex. When he was blonde, mm. he was whack. He wasn't, he wasn't whack. He wasn't no, he was whack. He was whack. When he was a tag team partner with... Brian Pillman. Was whack. No, they weren't. They weren't. They were good. Did you cry when Brian Pillman died? Did you cry? Did I cry? No. Stone Cold. I, I don't, don't think so, because they had a beef mm. at the time, didn't they? Mm. Remember, he shot him. Hmm? Oh, yeah. 
bang. Yeah. Remember, remember when Stoke, that's, Brian Pillman played a, played a big role in getting massed up by Stone Cold as he was growing, I remember. Yeah, there's a big part of why Stone Cold got big. Flipping up, big up Brian Pillman, man. But we were just watching WrestleMania 14 downstairs, does it? Yeah. WrestleMania 14 was good. <laughs> it was good, I Who think. Was, the main event then? Was, it, was it Triple H? Shawn Michaels and Stone Cold with Mike Tyson. Oh, we were fantastic. Triple H versus, H versus Owen Hart. Owen Hart. Yeah. Fantastic. China handcuffed to Sergeant Slaughter. <laughs> <laughs> who, who come up with that idea? <laughs> Imagine Sergeant Slaughter just, <laughs> you know what I mean? Man just go, man just, you know, okay? These chins Diggle, massive. Yeah, Diggle said they got the same chin. <laughs> Even China. China. So the ball feet chin. Oh. Bro, we shouldn't be laughing about Chai. I just remembered, man. Why? What's she? Owen Hart was you in that. You know that? that? Owen Hart no, was in Chai that match was, as well. China's gone, bro. You know, you know our shoulder shake to her. Paul, not China. Yeah, China. Facts, China. When Jordy when it first came out. China. <laughs> yeah. No way. I swear down now. Oh, hey, I shoulder shake to that. Well, she was a porn star. Mm-hmm. But yeah. Don't look at me. What? what? She, is she shoes out there? Yeah, she's gone. Yeah, she's gone. Ages ago. Ross, I didn't even know that one. T, China. Owen's up there as well. He's yeah, in that match. They use, they're using Owen a lot in battle rap now. I can't believe China's gone. <laughs> so, <laughs> man, man trying to deduct a shoulder shake. I've got you now. <laughs> <laughs> I've got you, I've got you. I've got oh you. I've got to take God. that one off now, man. And you know what's funny, yeah? You know when I saw him on, on the screen? I was like, you know what, yeah? <laughs> I'm going to go back and watch it when I get in. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. I can't watch it now, man. <laughs> you know oh. what I'm thinking? I might go back and watch it. I hate when that, I hate that kind of stuff happen. Like like Chris Atsu, God bless him. When us people football season, football manager season, I had another season before that. When he passed away, I had to start again. Because <laughs> now I have to take it back the game. He's he just, he's just there. He shouldn't be there no more. He's up in three. You know what I'm saying? I can't carry on that season. <laughs> Is that bad? <laughs> I hate when that stuff happens. You know what I'm saying? Is, is this a bad take here? Is this a bad take? Did China look like Rihanna a bit? <laughs> <laughs> Crowd, not Crowd. to make this too much like that no. at all. Yeah. But <laughs> did, we, did Rihanna and China look a, a bit alike? Just, just look at their heads. Honestly, T. No, I'm not looking and I'm not, I'm not doing that comparison. Yeah, there. And they're like there, innit? That's proper sad, man. <laughs> what do you mean this, this proper sad China went? No, because I was thinking about doing it. <laughs> I was watching it when I was watching it on the downstairs. To China now? Yeah. Oh my Why God. not? It's good oh. to watch the, the vintage on the best. Go on, it go on, go on it to thing, man. To your shirts, man. So you ain't got a porno? No, but she's got mag- like. Nah, that, 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 that's there's, there's, it. There's, there's carpets out in the magazines. It don't work for me, man. None of that stuff. You need, I need proper action. That's what I'm saying. All that magazine stuff. What do you think I'm in jail or something? No. <laughs> <laughs> I need proper action. <laughs> Proper action, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> she got a bicep, man. She got a serious bicep, and you want to rattle that? Hmm? You got bad taste, man. What's that about her, man? Oh, oh well. Um, all right, well, we've we've remembered wrestling as we always do, but you know what we need to do now? No news. No. For <laughs> sake. <laughs> We're gonna help Rishi. Oh, Rikishi Shu, uh, with Shakur. I forgot about him, man. Daza, have you been keeping up with what we've been trying to do with Rikishi Shakur? No, I haven't. He's the Prime Minister of um, GB. Well, he's, he's had a rough start to his time as Prime Minister. Obviously, he inherited the job from Liz Truss mm-hmm. after a failed um, budget by Kwasi Kwarteng. Mm-hmm. Do you remember him? I do. Yep. And he's, he's in power now. And he's trying to make it so that he does enough in this cost of living crisis, this gas crisis and everything else to be able to win the next election and maybe do something great for the people of this country. Okay. We don't do party politics. We don't want Conservative, Labour, Lib Dems, Scottish National Party. We don't care who it is. We just want the people to be best served. We want the best policies for the people. Mm-hmm. We, as a show, as a no rules show, not we as a nation. We as a nation seem to want so the worst for ourselves. For example, one one of the uh, things we wanted removed was podcasts. Yes, and it's, it's people. A lot of people have agreed with us. It's too many podcasts out there. Yeah. Facts. This is what I'm saying. This is what's making it so hard for me to do my podcast because there's so many. That's what I'm saying. If we get rid of a few of them, <laughs> maybe I can come through. <laughs> do you remember, when we, remember when we tried Specs and Friends? Oh God. 
Don't talk to you. <laughs> we'll respect some friends. We tried to meet all of me and all of my friends. Me, Dazzo, oh, Rado, 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 Frosty. Yeah, you sent me that. Oh, Kaz, everyone, bro. It was hard. Tigo was like, it's impossible to do 20 man, one camera. But we're moving around. Yeah. But yeah, we said, we, we said too many podcasts. Yeah, we've, we've had policies about uh, teaching financial literacy to kids rather than like trivial subjects, teaching them about taxes. So if they would have taught us business from, you know, early in 99, you would have been waiting around in college doing nothing. You would, we would have had no rules, boxes and socks by then. Yeah. Or the Braveheart boys or he's whatever probably, you want to call it. To be fair, he's probably saved money mm. by wearing no rules boxes. Yeah, it's true. How much would you have spent on boxes? Probably a lot. When I go Primark, I spend about... Yeah, eight pound every now and again still, especially when I can't be bothered to wash them. So I'm saying you now. <laughs> what, what's wrong with my boxes? <laughs> well, what I can't be bothered to wash them is yeah. the bit that's yeah, funny, yeah, I think. Yeah, yeah, Certain times when I get in from work and I'm tired, get me, I'm meant to put it in a wash, but I play FM, then after FM I get a bit tired and go to bed, then I realise I ain't got the boxes to wear the next day. Yeah. So then I have to dip into the door rules. So I'm saying, oh, <laughs> okay, okay. I thought, you meant, I thought you meant you went and bought some eight pound boxes. Yeah, that as well. Yeah, 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 no, that, no, that as well. No. Every now and again when I'm there, I'll buy some, so I'm saying. But yeah, where else? I wanna, I wanna, I actually want Rikish Shunat to, um, or Shakur, whatever you wanna call him, to change something. Mm-hmm. Album launch parties. Right, that's a good shout. Me and the, I said, I made a point to us yesterday, it was, 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 was that a album launch party? But the artist performed two tunes. And we were like, rah, oh. DJ started playing music. We thought it was class. But we've got friends who, we're not gonna say their names, but we've got friends in our area who've been doing music since, pff, what does it, 2001? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one cares. Mm-hmm. But when we, when they're performing, <laughs> when they're performing to you, 30 tracks, and we have to stand there and show eye contact, and uh, after every tune finish, brap, and then they say, now this next song. <laughs> <laughs> When they say this next song, and you're like, oh. oh. oh yeah. And then it's, it gets worse. Because right. they sometimes they rap, mm. and like, there are eight songs in, and you're done. You're, tr- you're getting close to the door. <laughs> <laughs> and we hear is, I just want to love you. This <laughs> guy's <laughs> a hook. <laughs> Yo, you should be laughing at my man still. <laughs> T, it's got to go. They say you reckon you should get rid of them. I think, yeah, I think, yeah, Matt or all, we say Max two, tunes. Max two songs. Me and Dazzle were shocked. Me and Dazzle, obviously Dazzle was up there, he, he was all the way up there, but was jamming, and I was thinking, damn, Dazzle eating prawns and chips, I'm not going to see him for one hour. Yeah. But when she finished and I went upstairs and we sat, I was like, bro, you know what, that's class. You should have mm-hmm. gone and listened to the album. Should have, innit? I wouldn't listen to her artist, I think she was all right. Let's promote her now. She was all right, yeah, she was all right. Big up Nina Rose, man. Nina Rose, big up Nina Rose, man. Nina Rose Afrobeats? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna try and find her. Mm. Mm. Okay, Nina Rose on Instagram, the underscore Nina Rose. She's London Ghanaian, and the music for the listening party you went to was "Come Over." Uh, I don't know if it's an album or no, a song. A single. single. Okay, so everyone go run that up. Let us know on Instagram that. If it wasn't for Dazza, you wouldn't know who she was, but Brap. thank you, Dazza. Thank you. That's a little free ball right there. Let's see what you are doing there. So she changed the game. She's now made it clear that people that are doing them album launch, whatever, single, whatever cool, just two tunes. Followed by Steve-O the Madman. No way. Come on, big up Steve-O, man. He's single now, isn't he? All right, Dazza, well, well, have you got anything that you need fixing? Anything that you don't like, Dazza? Remember when you're driving? Or, well, there's anything that you don't like that you want the Prime Minister to remove ASAP. Shoulder bullying? That as well, shoulder bullying still. I don't like it. I, I, I don't like that joke that he came up with. What's shoulder bullying? <laughs> <laughs> he said, I don't like I'm holding him. <laughs> it's like in your suitcases. <laughs> that one was funny, though. Know? I didn't even know he said that. I, mean, I, re- I read the comments, because I don't read it all the time, obviously. But I read the comments once. He said, <laughs> he said I look like I'm holding two. Hey, look, I'm holding a suitcase. That one there <laughs> was that? funny, still. So. Uh, you said it. I like, don't remember. You showed me. It won't be on me. <laughs> But yeah, what would I look like? Um, Do you know what I want to change? Check-ins for flights. Why do I have to check in two hours before? 
Just let me check in. Just let me walk to my flight. Oh, makes sense. Yeah. You're right. So you mean, yeah, because even like if you do the online check-in, yeah. you say you got, you got your phone and that. And if you forget it, you got a queue up. It's yeah. a good idea. Yeah, just let me through. You say that. You, are you saying this because you want to go to New York next week? <laughs> I'm going to New York next week. <laughs> I'm in New York right now, actually. Oh, yeah, you're right. So you're in there right now. I'm going to change, definitely change stuff with cars, though. Like all these energy lights that come on the cars, man. I need cars to just work normally still. I spent about four or five bills on cars. It's getting ridiculous now. Everyone's having car problems. It's tough, man. Well, in terms it. of repairs and that. Yeah, man. Like, just lights just start coming up out of nowhere. Deep. You're driving. Deep. <laughs> That's not lights. Deep. Right? Like, like, That's a seatbelt time. Lights don't make noise. <laughs> yeah, yes, they do make noise. They come up, they say, deep. They make noise. So what? You ain't never driven. How are you meant to know what a car makes? Boy, it does He's driving. His seatbelt, yeah, he's not on. Beep, 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 beep. No, my car's broken. <laughs> the oil light is gone again. <laughs> he's gone to the mechanic. You hear that noise? It's your seatbelt. Are you, are, you, are, you, are, you, are you dumb? Look at the light. It's red. It's your seatbelt ball. <laughs> no, I had different lights. And the reason why I said this is because one time I had a girl in the car, yeah, and I was driving, yeah. She was like, this is her to me. Like, we just went over a bump and she said, you said car's going to make it? I thought, what are you talking about? <laughs> you said, what you say that? Because like, your, your edge lights on. It's going to move off. <laughs> it's like, your edge lights on. That kill me. That kill me. That's so embarrassing. How can I get on your edge lights on? <laughs> so, yeah, man. Hey, car manufacturers, just take all of that stuff out, man. <laughs> all the warnings. <laughs> or let it be on your phone. So, if, if an engine light comes, it comes on your phone. <laughs> it vibrates. Yeah, so, <laughs> my car, turn on my car. <laughs> Break lights on. <laughs> I need to change my fog lights. <laughs> deep. Just bear deep, 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 deep in. It's embarrassing. Oh my that's God. That's one thing I'll definitely change. That's the thing that Rikishi Shakur's in charge of that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Facts. <laughs> that's like Ranger Change that, man. One. It's embarrassing. Oh, I don't, that's not, I don't think you're going to win a lot of votes with that one. T, would you ever drive though? Yeah, I'm going to drive. No. You can't, you can't. What car, you, t- t- what car would you get? Yeah. This is a big Remember, you know what Longest said to me? Longest said to me, if you're, if you're over six foot four, you have to be in a the Range Rover. You have to. So what are you getting? I don't understand the question. What car are you getting, T? What did you just say? Range Rover. You can't, you can't afford that. <laughs> <laughs> Is he mad? Oi. What are you gonna get? How are you gonna get a range on? Finance? You get your range that you want. <laughs> <laughs> T, you're not getting a range. It's 11, it's 11% interest on cars right now. 11%. Come on, T, man. You, oh my God. I can never imagine Tigo driving. I would never get in the car with Tigo. <laughs> you man driving socks. <laughs> Deal with that, man. That, you can't trust man like that. I've driven with you, listening to your own mixes from 2005, of you shouting over Jeezy songs. I was in the set in my bedroom. <laughs> he knows what song's coming in next. That means he's rinsed his mix. <laughs> no, I'm praying that you don't know, live from the bedroom mix, yeah? yeah. Like, we're driving. We hear big up Dazza! <laughs> 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 oh, oh. <laughs> what a mix! <laughs> <laughs> How can I big up Dazza in my room? Because <laughs> I know I'm going to give Dazza the CDs to drive. He needs to drive, so I've got to big him up. He's <laughs> the only, only listener. I'm, I'm hiding that from Jordi and Tigo. I've heard it. It's Clangers all over the place. <laughs> all right. Well, Dazza, we've, we've been having fun. You've kind of introduced a law. I don't know if I would count it as a law, but um, yeah, it's not really a law, is it? Hide, hide the warning signs on cars. No, I'm just saying take them out completely. So, <laughs> take them out completely. Yeah. So you'll never know when something's breaking. No, it's speed, don't it? I just don't want nothing wrong with the car at all. <laughs> oh, <laughs> saying. fixed cars. Oh, electric, yeah. electric. No, they get problems no, too. Electric, they electric. get a lot of problems, yeah. I drive electric vans. I work and they're the worst, man. But you know what it's time for? It is time for No Rules News. Got there in the end. You got there in Finally, the end. Man. I don't know what's on my mind. How many episodes have you done of this? Uh, this first news story comes from GQ. Big up GQ, M- man. Meet the men paying to have their jaws broken in the name of manliness. You know what reminds me of? In the name of manliness. To show that you're a man. You get your jaw broken. You know what this reminds me of? That stupid sport I see with the time that pops up on my TikTok. I don't get what people. I don't s- get T. I, I, we should ask Rikishi to remove that game. But it's not. It's, it's, it's in it's, America. It? It's in America and Russia. T, you slap my ear and bang. 
Pop what? my pop my eardrum. Oh, Bants. That's not funny. You pop my eardrum. Dylan, How much come on. Man. Getting paid? Well, these guys are actually grow a growing number of men, often motivated by the darkest corners of the web, are paying vast sums to have their jaws broken and reshaped in the hope that a manlier mandible might transform them into alphas or chads. So they're restructuring instead of getting plastic surgery or whatever. They want manlier jawlines, so they're having them broken and then reshaped so they can be a little bit squarer, a little bit more like tough. Why? For what? For, for, that, for that day in a club where someone tries to bang you from behind, but it don't work because you're, uh, you're steady. No, it's because they think women want men with strong jawlines. Like Quagmire. Like Quagmire, <laughs> yeah. Or China or Sergeant Slaughter. Quagmire always wants oh, to beat something, doesn't oh, it? Oh, man, China. Oh, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, that set me man. That upset me. Guys, I love China. I never knew this, man. But the girls look at that, though. The girls look at oh. your jewels and think, mm. oh, you know, mummies are strange, man. Let's be real, they're strange. I think if Specs is anything to go by, 1.4, right? 1.4, yeah. They don't look at jaw lines. Hold on, hold on. I just remember something. I Yesterday, I bought the mummy with the bedroom for you. The bedroom wasn't interested in you at all. <laughs> So <laughs> How many times did she go in the smoking area? She don't even smoke. She's trying to get away from the swan. No, I knew her, I knew her, I knew her, I knew her. I knew her. No, she likes you, she <laughs> told me. I'll, I'll send it you after. Of course she likes me. Of course she likes me. It's, it's hard bigger than does. Have you got a friend? Uh, yeah, kinda. You got a picture? That's a get ready. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that back vibe one time? Remember? It went. <laughs> yeah, it's cool. Why you sending that picture, man? You're a hater. <laughs> you could be a hater. The girl, that, the girl said to me, the girl said to me, wait, maybe she's the last speaker. Wait, have you got another picture? Have you got another picture? <laughs> Broke my heart, mate. I took it all out of bed. I told you, I didn't want to pause like that on the bed. Why are you going to be pausing like that? <laughs> oh, yeah. On the bed. <laughs> let me see, 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 let me see. All right, do it again, do it again. <laughs> let me see, let me see. Send it. What did she say? Why did you send that one? <laughs> <laughs> you hater. <laughs> you pronounced the T. <laughs> oh my T, God. See that stinks though. There. Imagine uh, I got my phone and I said, T, pose for this mummy. You posing, yeah. you're finished. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you can't pose. You're in trouble unless you're- Find an old picture or something. <laughs> yeah. Unless it's long, you gotta take a live picture. Best. You gotta take a picture. I'll think about my best now, to be honest with you. You said you peaked in 999. <laughs> nah, you know what? Let me take that back. I think I'm at my best right now You're still. Peaking, where, I'm, where I'm losing weight and I'm, you know I'm saying, I'm gonna go gym. I'm the same, man. I think I'm gone. I'm this summer is gonna be long for you, man. This next story is from the Philadelphia Inquirer. Security robots are at Philly Lowe's stores. Some have already nicknamed them snitch bots. So there's little robots at shopping centers in Philadelphia. Easy to block, Captain. It's from Philly. It's from Philly. Sorry. They are uh, five foot tall, egg shaped robots that are following customers and make cosmic whirring sounds as they like glide along the pavement, ooh, 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 as it's gliding along, tracking people, trying to find people who are shoplifting. That's good though, isn't it? Because now, you know, bad people can't say the same thing anymore. Yeah, you're just racist. You can't really say that to a robot, can you? It's a good idea. Can. Can. Someone's programming the robot. Yeah, they can say it's programmed to watch black people. Yeah. You think so? <laughs> There's no difference. Well, that's, that's even better, isn't it? Because it means you can hide. White people can hide from the fact that you know they're racist. I like that. That's you probably wanna know, you wanna know who's programmed it. You've you've just made one of the probably the most succinct points about programming and AI and robots in the future that probably anyone's ever made. White people can now hide from software. They can be like, "It wasn't me. It wasn't me. <laughs> the software it did it." It wasn't me. You know what I mean? Put that there. You this. You that. <laughs> Sorry, me. <laughs> <laughs> The, the K5 autonomous outdoor security robots, which are manufactured by Nightscope, a security tech company based in the Silicon Valley, are part of a pilot project to heighten the security and safety of our locations, said Larry Costello's Lowe's senior manager of corporate communications. So they've literally got robots driving around the car park. Yeah, just, uh, and I believe it. I, I, know, I know America will be the first country to bring even more robots. Because I even saw, I saw a video of... Uh, uh, it was a robot bird. Yeah, they, they, someone sent it to me and it was just flying around, but it was like a drone, a camera watching people. 
So they, they, this, yeah, is, this is how they're starting. This is how they're yeah, starting. They've got even, I see something about a human robot. Have you seen it where it touches it, the nose and it gets angry or it moves your hand? But his eyes are moving. Yeah. Literally like a human. You've seen that one there? Is it? So yeah, man. They're and getting, obviously they're Biden's got some human robots walking with him as well. So yeah, this is, this is, this is real. But the thing is, I'm just, you're going to buy a ham sandwich. Yeah. You're in Philadelphia. And this robot's just behind you. Ain't that gonna irritate you though? Just because you know robots make noise. Apparently it goes. Ooh, 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 that's the noise it makes. Well, but would it bother you though? I don't feel okay because I'm always gonna pay for it. Yeah, you're not. You're not the thief. I'm just trying to think about that. What if it accuses you of stealing? And you didn't steal. See, that's the problem. If a robot accuses me of stealing, and I don't. I can't argue. No, <laughs> facts. Oh my God, I don't even think of that. So what's it does if it catches someone? It makes a noise, I guess, and it alerts a human security. And then there's video footage built into it, probably. All right, let me ask you this. It depends if it's a, or a, a male voice or a female voice. Right, that, why does it have to have a voice? Because then I could change my game on that. You know, I'm not trying to, I'm just trying to get your attention. <laughs> the egg, like, egg-shaped robot. I mean, it, it dumb, I mean, I'm not, he, if he, what, what wants to do China? <laughs> what makes you think Dyson is gonna say no to a robot? <laughs> Come on, Dyson wants to break metal somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> hey, for the right amount of money we're talking, boys. So. Oh, you, right. you, <laughs> you keep asking for money to sleep with things. <laughs> is everything all right? <laughs> you got too many socks. <laughs> I'll beat a fly for 50 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> Once we catch it. <laughs> I, I hate these impressions on me, you know. I hate them, man. I hate them. <laughs> you know what? We got. Be, we're gonna get, we have to meet Banksy. Banksy's coming in one day. Oh, Banksy's ba- the best. Oh, yeah. oh, it's one more you need to meet. When you meet Banksy, oh my God. <laughs> This next story is from bloodyelbow.com, part of SB Nation, big sports network. Steven Seagal launches Aikido Center to train Russians for military service. Is Steven Seagal still going? <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with this guy? <laughs> still got a ponytail. Yeah. Still, he's, got, he's got like packs in it, like six packs on his cheeks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my God, he's, he's still up. I, I thought he'd be doing... I'm sure if you go on Steven Seagal's Instagram, or his bio will say crypto something. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. He's done. He started his own crypto coin. I knew it. You I think it tell. went out of business though. You can tell. But he's good friends with uh, Vladimir Putin. What? Yeah. Oh yeah, I saw them in a picture together. Yeah. Wasn't he at like the Champions League final or something as well when it was in Russia? And he was up in the box oh, with Putin. Yeah, I remember. Yeah. So, what, what, is he Eastern European? Steven Seagal, yeah. he's American. He's just friends with Putin. That's crazy, man. Americans got beef for Putin in a way. But Steven Seagal, okay, that's my boy. Well, Steven Seagal is very much on that side. He's like, yeah, let's do this. So where's he living right now? That's what I want to know. Oh, wow. I don't know how safe it would be for him to come back because he's good friends with Putin and, and Americans would love to get someone who's good friends with Putin. You know, my only memory of Steven Seagal was Mark for Death. <laughs> Which wow. is a classic. He... Broke every Jamaican's neck. Do you know Mark for Death? T- Daza, the yardies, the yardies against Steven Seagal, and he just kept taking their heads off their shoulders. It's the one. It's, it's yardies versus yardies Steven Seagal. against Steven Seagal, and he yeah. wins. I love that film. Why? I don't think I've seen. Because well, when was the last time you see a bunch of yardies trying to take down Arnold Schwarzenegger? That's <laughs> true. Yeah, they, they, Arnold Schwarzenegger didn't give yardies any shine. George Clooney against yardies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Steven Seagal's got that page. I don't think I've seen that one. You, you know, know what? I Yardies, might Yardies might only appear in one. There you go. Movie. That's why I've stored it. Obviously, they've got like Jamaican movies. In um, Bad Boys Two is yeah. Haitians. Haitians. Yeah, there, yeah. there might be That's Yardies, I but I don't think they're, they're, they're Haitians. Even, even um, uh, John Wick's. Right. Uh, I don't know what chapter it is, but there's a there's a part where he goes against new, like different gangs from different countries. So yeah, you've yeah. Got the triads yeah. you got. Mm-hmm. Italian Mafia. Again, you never, I never saw no Yardies. Because Yardies, like, the Yardie gang, they're up there with, obviously they're not as, I'd say powerful as the Mexicans and all this stuff, but everyone knows what a Yardie, like a Yardie gang is, you know what I'm saying? So I'm surprised that they just got that one movie clip. It's not fair to you, man. IMDB says, obviously uh, there's Yardies in Snatch. 
Snatch with Will Smith. No, Snatch with Brad Pitt and... Oh, I'm thinking about Hitch. Okay, so they're in Snatch. Mm-hmm. Mark for Death. Yep, big film. Gangs of London, London thing, I get it. Uh, Shutters, that's Jamaican big film. film. Big best film, film, best film, sure. Yardi, that's English. Um, to Be Someone, I don't know what that is. It's English again, though. Rolling with the Nines, English. This is all English stuff. Apparently, they were in an episode of Miami Vice. But there are only 13 films or TV shows. That's interesting. With Yardi what in a fact. the description. So we need more. We need, we need Yardi's in Fast and Furious 9. Yeah. Yeah, no, let's put it out there. That we need Yardi's in um, Taken. Oh, I ain't seen Liam. I... Oh, you know what, T? This is a great, this is a great shout. You know, we need more yardies in these, these battles. We, we, you, we don't care if you shoot them up or whatever. They just gotta be there. Yeah, representation. But Steven Seagal, I'm sure he beat up all these yardies with just his bare hands, T. Oh no, he had a lot of weapons as well. Sure. Yeah. Old than no? nunchucks, because he does aikido. I can't believe he's funding a war to go against. He's French. training the war. He's training the soldiers. So he, can't, he can never come back then. <laughs> he could never come back to America. In theory, like if Shemima Begum can't go back to England, mm. and all she did was run away with um, someone from another country in the war, then surely if Stevens and Girls teach him Russian soldiers how to do backflips and that, he can't go back to America. Otherwise, we've got to let Shemima That's Begum in. That's interesting, boy. Correct me if I'm wrong or right. Did Stephen Gustago, was he, like, did he get his name of Bruce Lee? Or am I thinking about someone else? Is that it, it started his career? Was was he in Enter the Dragon as like a sm- no? That's Chuck Norris, isn't it? Yeah, you're thinking of Chuck Norris. Sorry, man. Chuck Norris is way better than Steven. Oh, of course, Chuck Norris. Is he T? Chuck Norris. Oh, oh, good question. That's a great question. Is Chuck Norris downstairs? He is. Why? And he's 83 years old. Whoa. Yeah. Let's check personal life, see if he's done anything mental. Oh, I'd love to, innit? Chuck Norris is a legend, man. How much for Chuck Norris? 50, ge- 50 bags? Yeah, not everything's about money, innit? <laughs> <laughs> not everything's about money, man. <laughs> I can't do everything for money. That's a good answer, man. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll do one more uh, news story. This one's for Dazza, because I want to know how much for this story. CBS Boston, man arrested for threatening MBTA riders with pet rat named Jerry. <laughs> and that MBTA means tube. Pet rat. Pet rat. You threaten them. <laughs> An MBTA Class. rider, which is like the tube, is accused of <laughs> Jerry threatening fellow passengers with his pet rat. And police say this isn't the first time he and his ro- rodent have caused problems on the T. T is like the tube, basically. Transit police arrested 57-year-old Jeffrey Stewart, Boston man, who they say is well known for causing problems with a rat named Jerry. He was taken into custody at Oak Grove Tea Station about 4 p.m. Thursday evening. Police said he was also drinking and being disorderly. Apparently, he was yelling at patrons and putting a rat near their faces. Oh, my. <laughs> I mean, oh, having a rat as a pet is mad. Oh, a lot of people have rats oh. as pets. A lot of people have rats as pets. Rats. Rats are... Rats are oh, no one clean they're very intelligent animals they're very clean unless they're in the streets like most animals like wild dogs it's the difference between a wild dog and a dog it's not normal tea how popular no. are rats as pets six percent of pet owners own a rat or mouse see that's strange weird behavior it's, un- it's undateable it's undateable business that is wrong more people own rats than gerbils it's like a hamster. So wait, wait, hold on, hold on. You're telling me that he's gone around just putting his rat in people's faces? Yeah, but like it's a gun. <laughs> <laughs> See, you, you know what's bad? You know what was at the Channel 4 shoot the other day, yeah? Yeah. Which one? He's done two. Leicester with Chloe Burrows. One of the challenges, and I don't care if we're not supposed to say this, no rules, was we had to go and find somebody that had the weirdest animal in Leicester. Yeah. And you know what someone had? They had an animal I've never seen in my life before, see, I've never heard of. And I'm gonna call Chloe right now. Please, Chloe, pl- please, Chloe, tell me you're, you're at home, not, you're not filming. One second. She's not filming. 
Hello. Hey, Chloe. Hey, what's going on? All right, Chloe, you're live on No Rules right now. Do you oh, my God. On Channel oh, 4. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Chloe, the animal yeah. that um the, the, the other team pulled out on Channel 4 the other day, what was it called? The animal. Do you remember the animal? Parrot. A what? A ferret. A ferret. A ferret. Ferret. A ferret. <laughs> what is it? Ferret. Ferret. A ferret. A ferret. Yes. Ferret. All right. Yeah, ferret. ferret. We'll talk about yeah. it right now. No rules. Thank you, Chloe. Okay. No rules. Bye bye. Bye, Chloe. Bye. <laughs> old bed friend, man. <laughs> you between it, you between it, man. You would, you would never meet Chloe as well. Uh, uh, you, you know why? You know I always why. block it. Of course, you get her. Of course, you can. <laughs> <laughs> Right, yeah, six right. How much for a parrot? Parrot. What to drop it? Yeah. <laughs> the guy had six. My 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 six. my 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 thing. Well, it's, yeah, it would have worked. So. How can you have a ferret as a, a little as girls a, can't manage it as a little ferret? T. Does he had six of those? That's a bit that poet as well. Isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> He's got his porky face. Most we had girls can't handle it, but a little ferret. <laughs> <laughs> Will explode, it was a slow man. Oh, we big that's for a reason. We big that's for a reason. I was looking at it thinking, right, and I held it. I held it, bro. You held it? I held you. it. Ask Chloe, I held it, bro. I had it in my hand, I was looking at it thinking, yeah, that's thinking, bro, you know what? Maybe. So maybe we've got, we got to change our mentality of these animals. I don't mean you, when we see rats, we're, 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 we're off. But we've got to change our mentality. We gotta change our mentality, man. Uh, my mentality ain't changed for a rat or a mouse. Ferret, maybe. Well, a mouse. So. I can't stand mice as well. Like anything that moves way too quick. Yeah, let me quick. Oh, <laughs> that makes sense. Which one stands up? <laughs> that, that's just, the bad mouse goes. Shh. That's like, <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> you should have said I'm dopey. You should have said. Anything that moves too quick, I'm not on it. So I'll be with you. So if I put a rat in my face on the train, I'm punching man up, man. Still, we I'm need, kicking we need him. Mice to lose pace, so that Dazzle can't won't be scared of them. Murder sucker, mice. Um. <laughs> <laughs> if it moves slow, then yeah, I'm cool. If I can see it, but it's only ones where you don't see it. Like I had the mouse in my house one time, and it went past. I was like, was that a mouse? Yeah, yeah. that's what I mean. <laughs> that's, and that's then, then I saw it. Then I saw it in the kitchen. I'm looking at it. Yeah, I ain't got glasses on. I think what's that? I was about to pick it up. I thought it was a sock. And it kicked, I'm telling you now, I kicked out quicker than that mouse. I don't play mouse. That's a it was a sock. <laughs> it's a normal sock, it's black. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me show, spec this. <laughs> I can't stand them, boy. So oh weird. my God. Lock him up, man. Lock him up for 20 years, 30 years, man. <laughs> the guy with the I rat. Can you put, yeah, I can you put a rat in someone's face. <laughs> Disrespectful, boy. Oh my God. All right. That was no rule show. You got New York for you, weren't we get off of work. No. Yeah. Come on, come on. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. You think you think you can just get up and go n- New York when there's no rules to do? We've we've recorded them. Oh, you wanna play that game? We're not dropping on Easter because it's that like, Jesus is just about to be killed. This is guy. See this guy. Specs. We have to record every week. You figure out someone in New York? No, you gotta record no rules. And all of a sudden he's just stopping at Easter. So why didn't you invite us? Exactly. You got me. Go on. That you've asked two questions there. Yeah. I'll answer. He's I'll, right I'll, no, I'll, 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 I'll answer. <laughs> right today. I'll answer the first one first. Go on. You didn't come Barcelona. Why did I come Barcelona again? There was a reason. There was a reason. All right, cool. There was a reason. So I'm not bother inviting you to New York. Kind no, of no, no. That's just once, though. That's just once. If I had a reason, I'm not saying which I can't remember what it was. I have a reason. Now. We're going to Barcelona again this year. He's anyway. going to Jamaica middle of next month you start of end of next month yeah so we've we've got um we've got to do no rule shows then and you've got a passport of course <laughs> <laughs> of course of course we remember we've been in cancun yeah let me just remind you passports expire <laughs> oh yeah yeah they do and they, and they renew <laughs> 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 let him know let him know <laughs> let him T, let me just let you know 2010 yeah me dad's a runner were flying out the country yeah, yeah. I was I was in Cancun in 2010. <laughs> yeah, right. 
Yeah. Where's 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 the files? I'll, I'll bring you files. Yeah, I'll bring you. Files. You were in Cancun when we were there. No, when you were there. No, I was. I wasn't like. Wow, look, look there's runner. <laughs> <laughs> what does he think of Boris in 2010? He's the mayor. <laughs> Run off! <laughs> run off! Oh, I told you you got to stop this shit. Big doing, man. runner, you know. <laughs> um, but yeah, happy birthday, Jordy. It's his birthday tomorrow. Oh. Yeah, wait. You asked my second question. Who you done with? My girl. Oh, okay. oh you, you got a girl now too, yeah? I need to see her still. <laughs> <laughs> I need to see what you're working with because this is the first time I've heard Tigo's got a girl. Is that what I'm saying? First time, Phil. Tigo's a liar, man. That's a... Man, missed you, bro. Yeah, we missed you, man. Missed you too, man. We missed you, man. We missed, missed you, you too. It's been a minute. And um, the crowd are going to say we want Dazza next week, but it doesn't work like that. Next week, you've got somebody else. Uh, yeah. You kind of like. We'll, you know. we'll get you on Filthy, though, in the next yeah. couple of weeks. You need to be on Filthy. There's no reason for you not to be on Filthy. It should be a we good issue. a lot of football. Mm. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So I've got a lot to say, man. I missed some good episodes as well. Last episode was good as well. But this is my favorite episode of the year, not because Daz is my guy and he's on. But it's the fact that we've become business partners, all of us. Yeah, we're this now, we're now in business This is the first time on the together. podcast where an agreement has made, been made right here. Filthy at five.com if you want a pair of these socks. What sizes have they got them? Small, mar- large, medium? Yeah. Small, medium and large. Uh, we, don't, we don't know the pants yet. We don't know the situation with the pants. We'll figure out the situation yeah. with the pants. If you smell a bit of oil or petrol, that kind of stuff, right, mate. it's <laughs> Daz's thing. You so allow him. <laughs> allow him. But yeah. if you buy a pair, you leave your phone number in the um, in the description of your purchase. Mm. You will get a voice note from Dazza. Oh, that's a great. That's class. Your biz- you know your business, man. You, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna I'm gonna give you some money to go to New York. <laughs> 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 go buy go buy what you want. <laughs> oh, <Jordy. laughs> oh, what a show!